So get ready for this boys FIFA 17 Official gameplay has been leaked Yes, you, you have heard it here From your boy It has been leaked And I, I find that Most of y'all, my FIFA audience Needs to see this gameplay I mean The, the gameplay is, is pretty sick It's just pretty sick So I'm just gonna give for one spoiler just, just, just one, just one. Just, just. So for penalties Um there will not be any bad bottom but be in mind right that he play i don't and i'm not too sure if this is the full game that people play that he play uh he play, he play, he play. however yeah I, I don't know if the, it's the same game well it's a full game they play that he play well h3 they play there so yeah um so let's get straight into this video Let's cut your chase and let's get straight into it. So before I show you this video, please don't forget to like. Please don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to share my video. And actually listen with um to the guy. Well, listen to what the guy is saying. He actually explains a lot of stuff. So yeah, let's get straight into it. Hey everyone, it's Mark for Windows Central, and we are taking a look at a sample multiplayer gameplay for FIFA 17. Uh, I play FIFA a lot, it's probably what I play on my Xbox One 90% of the time when I power it up. So uh, yeah, I was really looking forward to uh, checking out FIFA 17 at E3 to 2016. All right, so here we go, the match just started. Um, what I noticed so far is that there are more details on the face. Uh, the graphics overall seem very similar to the, the previous version, but um, see the cinematics, when, when they go closer to the face, you notice the scars and uh, pimples. Um, the players look older than uh, what I remember from FIFA 16. So the controls are mostly the same. If you're used to playing FIFA 16, it's going to feel uh, very similar uh, controlling your player. Uh, what I do notice though is that defending and moving around is a little bit slower. Uh, and when you bump into other players, it, it slows you down more uh, compared to uh, FIFA 16. Uh, so I guess it's more realistic that way uh, and that could be a good thing. So the ball is about to go out here and uh, what I noticed is that when you throw in the ball, your player can actually move uh, left and right as you notice there. So what you're also going to notice that's different is the corner kick. The view is, uh, is different. Uh, you now see this ball indicator uh, and you move it around to place the ball and uh, the longer you hold the X button, uh, the more powerful the kick is going to be. It's different and uh, it takes time to get used to it. So what's also different is the free kick. Uh, you'll notice that the view is different. Uh, you, you have the ball indicator again, you move it around, and that's how you're going to uh, place the ball. Uh, but you can change the, the camera view, you press the LS button, and uh, that's going to go back to the view that you're used to on uh, FIFA 16. But here, he just ended up passing to his teammate. So now here's a look at another free kick, but closer to the goal. Uh, this is the view that we're used to already with FIFA 16. Uh, you press and hold the, the B button to shoot, and you hold the, the, LF, the left stick to make it spin.
So penalty kick is coming up here and uh, this one is also different from FIFA 16. And uh, yeah, there's no left and right um, meter here on the, and uh, we don't know what to do here. Um, and he's gonna miss it because uh, yeah, we, we have no idea what's happening. So this is new and uh, it's gonna get some time to get used to and uh, we'll see how it works. So I'm going to get a penalty kick here, um, again I don't know what to do here so I just guessed, point the left stick and press and hold the B button but not too long and uh, the ball actually goes in. Uh, but yeah, I do need to check the, the manual here when, the, when this game comes out to uh, figure out what the hell to do here. Alright, so that's a first look at FIFA 17. Uh, sample multiplayer gameplay. Uh, what do you think so far? Um, it looks very similar to FIFA 16 for the most part. However, when uh, the camera goes up close to, to the faces, you do notice that there are more details. You can see the scars, pimples. Uh, movement, uh, it does feel a little bit slower, but I think it's more realistic that way. When players bump into each other, it looks more real. Uh, this time compared to uh, the previous version. Uh, it does feel like when, when it comes to passes, you do need to be more accurate, uh, you need to be more patient. Uh, so overall, it does feel more real than uh, last year's version, and I do like that. All right, so after watching this gameplay, I'm curious what you think of the game so far. Let me know in the comments section below. That's all for now. I'm Mark Wim for Windows Central. Thanks for watching.